నమస్కారం శిష్యాగతం ఐ వెల్కమ్ మై రేడియం ప్లస్ వివేస్ రేడియం ప్లస్ వివేస్ టు లిసన్ వాట్ ఐ వాంట్ టెల్ యూ నా టుడే యాక్చువల్లీ దిస్ ఇస్ ద ఇంగ్లీష్ ప్రోగ్రామ్ నెంబర్ సిక్స్ జీరో సిక్స్ ఈపీ జీరో సిక్స్ బట్ బిఫోర్ దాట్ ఐ హ్యాడ్ టోల్ యూ ఈపి జీరో ఫైవ్ వరి ఇన్ ఐ యాక్చువల్లీ టుక్ వీర్ దాస్ అన్ ఎగ్జాంపులరీ personification that he was lecturing in america and denouncing uh, the indian culture and uh, in a very deadliest form like the deadliest scene to actually these persons like this there are millions of birdas in india there are millions of birdas in india and uh, these people are as equal to the act of uh, Karsav, who killed and his, part, and his uh, group of people uh, in 2008 in 26-11 case in Victoria Terminus, made by the British in Mumbai. Now, of course, Mumbai. So there, Karsav, uh, if you might have observed it, that in his right hand there is the sacred thread, thread uh, etc., just as if he is a Hindu. but actually he is a muslim terrorist and in his group there were some i don't know maybe 11 or 20 those terrorists to kill some maybe 3 to 400 people in victoria terminus and nearby places and all that in 2008 uh, when uh, mr manmohan singh was the prime minister and uh, the trio the trio no trio doesn't mean here the father the son and the holy ghost etc not of that of the bible Trayo here is, you know, uh, Manmohan Singh was the Prime Minister and uh, basic Trayo was um, your Rahul Ji, Papu Ji, uh, Priyanka Ji and uh, Sonia Gandhi. They are, I consider them as Trayo. They are present Trayo. So these people, you know, so actually these uh, millions of Virdas and the Trayo and that group who are actually who have uh, ruled india most of the period after independence so this over clever people whom i just consider them as the equal terrorists like the kasava who killed and not only that bombay had many blasts not one or two series of blasts held uh, probably from 90 and uh, 1990 uh, to 2000 etc and afterwards so these people you know they are actually disrespecting indian culture indian reputation indian uh, what i should say that um, they're condemning uh, our own religion and religious practice cultures etc etc so to satisfy the inner urge this uh, millions of virdas i am taking that example uh, as a pillar what is happening in india for so many years virdas to satisfy his inner urge to condemn bharatiya culture before the american audience who do not know anything about the eastern philosophy and this virdas the foolish and the fullest of all fools has taken the course to the uh, course to the dirty path Uh, to denounce india so why such people are behaving this way or doing this way what our sri gita says now in this point of view i will just inform you that i have opened a group facebook group uh, sri mad bhagavad gita sri gita sri gita philosophy is worldwide i want to take sri gita values philosophy text everything that builds the career of a person that is the beacon of the civilization that is the beacon of the humanity everything so i want to take it to the whole of the world uh, considering that uh, some vivekananda sri narendra nath dot his original name uh, lectured in chicago in 1893 and uh, if you compare Swami Vivekananda, what he said, his volumes of works are there in English. Anybody can read all those books. Anybody can read. It's in English. 
and he lectured in Chicago in English. So anybody can hear his lectures. And now you compare Swami Vivekananda's lecture in 1893 and this fellow Virdas millions of Virdas and those Kasava, hundreds of Kasava, thousands of Kasavas, millions of Kasavas who is disturbing India as a whole, as a whole. So what to see Gita says? I will take up two mantras. I will explain two mantras. The first mantra, what I want to tell you is that in uh, Panchadasha Abdhayo, Panchadasha Abdhayo is the Purushottama Yoga. Purush, the personification of what I should say, Lord Shiva. Utkramantam sthitam bapi bhunjanang ba gunan nitam. This is the tenth mantra of the Purushottama Yoga, fifteenth Adhyaya, Panchadas Adhyaya. Lord says, Lord Krishna is telling us that Utkramantam sthitam either it is going off or it is established in our body, the soul. Bapi bhunjanang ba gunan nitam. Either the soul is enjoying or it is exposing all its qualities. Bimura nanu pasyanti. Those the fullest of the fools. Those who are overwhelmed with the wrongdoings of the humanity. Those who are lacking wisdom. Those who are lacking judgment of the philosophy. That is the bimura. Nanu pasyanti. They cannot see anything. Because they are loaded, their brain is loaded with all sort of, all these uh, things, you know, what I have told you, that they are overwhelmed with the, uh, for, what I should say, the uh, uh, befooling the qualities, befooling the audiences, because the audiences are not that learned, even though they are Americans, they don't know the sacred philosophy of the East. So, Virdas is befooling the audiences of the America, you see, you see. And Virdas is lacking wisdom. See, the number two point. And Virdas is lacking judgment. So he is a Bhimura. He is a Bhimura. Nanu Pashanti. He cannot see through his enlightened eyes. Jnana Chokhusho. The eye, not this eye. The eye of the, from the brain that he can see, he can foresee. So this is the mantra most suitable for these type of people as I have told you so far, so long, from last five minutes. To tell you this particular mantra of the Lord Krishna in Srimad Bhagavati Gita of the Panchadasa Dhyo, the tenth number, sloka number, verse number ten. Utkamantam sthitam, either it is going off or it is there in my body, in my whole process of the physiological process of the mental process of the thought process. Thought process are in three dimension. Thought processes of human is of three dimensions, of three different types of. And here also we are Hindus because some are over clever, denounce their own thing, their, everything of our, their father or the forefather or the culture of the 5,000 or 10,000 years of civilization of India, of the religion, the religious culture, the ethics, the morality, and they don't, don't follow because they are dipped in seven deadly sin, as I have told you in my earlier a program and presentation. So, these fellows are Vimhura, Nana Pashanti, Pashanti, Jnana Chokkusho. Neither they can see through their wisdom, neither they can see through their judgment, neither they can, uh, they are befooled actually by all these things. These people, as I have told you, the millions of uh, Vardash, the millions of Kasavo, uh, so he has, he might have seen it, that there is a thread on his right hand side of the um, puja and the, from the goddess or the god that we normally Hindus we wear. You, you can observe it as if he is a Hindu. So they are the Hindu terrorists. These fools, you know, those who are uh, condemning us, uh, these, you know, the parties, political parties who actually favor and forwarding our religion and our culture and our civilization, our wisdom, our everything. So they are condemning as Hindu terrorist, but Hindu terrorists have those Muslims, those who are naming, they have what the name of the Hindu, uh, they are um, um, as if they are Hindus. So actually these fellows whomsoever I am telling you, the second mantra is of the Daivasura Sampadviva, the Yoga, the Shastra Dhyaya, number seven. God, what Lord is telling, 
ప్రవృత్తించ నివృత్తించ జననో విదురాసుర అర్థాత్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద ప్రవృత్తి దట్ మీన్స్ ది మెంటల్ అండ్ బాడీలీ ఆర్జ్ ద ఆర్జ్ ఫ్రమ్ ఇన్ సైడ్ ద స్ట్రాంగ్ డిజైర్ ది స్ట్రాంగ్ డిజైర్ ఆఫ్ హ్యూమెన్ ద స్ట్రాంగ్ డిజైర్ ఆఫ్ హ్యూమెన్ ద ద పీపుల్ యు నో దిట్ ఈస్ ఎ మెంటల్ విత్ ఇస్ ఫిజికల్ ఎనీథింగ్ ఎనీ స్ట్రాంగ్ డిజైర్ దట్ కమ్స్ అవుట్ and they want to satisfy their desire whether it is right whether it is wrong whether you should do it whether you should not do it whether it is holy whether it is unholy nothing matters to their mind they don't bother for all these things only thing they want to satisfy their lust they want to satisfy their greed everything the seven deadly sin as i have told you ah uh, so uh, these things are actually they want to satisfy them and that is the reason vidurashura whether it is this holy tune or it is not holy or unholy they don't bother no shochang na pichacharo no satyam teshu vidyate no shochang means they don't have any purification they are not pure they are impure and na pichacharo they don't have any good uh i'm not the good behavior good uh, what i should say good doings Yeah, nothing like that and no satyam teshu vidyate they don't have they don't have inside the self inner sense no truth is them with them that is called no satyam teshu vidyate so this thing you know the pravrittincha nivrittincha jana no vidurasura these fellows you can just uh, group them you can just group them it's not a facebook group i'm not grouping with these fellows i want to group with the people who likes to learn sri gita mantras and to spread it to the whole world and i want people those who can give their own opinion their own explanation in writing in videos or lecturing or the presentation so that's why i have opened a group in my facebook page and the name i have given sri gita one gap then philosophies one gap and then worldwide so these two mantras as i am explaining today as i have told you in the first um, mantra what is that that utkraman sthitam bapi bhunyanam ba gunan nitam whether you are enjoying in your health in your body in your everything in your stomach in your belly in your everything you are enjoying or the qualities that you are exposing the two things you are enjoying and you are exposing so that thing whether uh, as long as it goes on in a well manner in a what i should say in a correct manner there is no problem huh? but those who are overwhelmed with what be fooled by others or be fooled by some bad element be fooled by some bad uh, teachings you know bad teachings or lacking wisdom they don't want to learn anything they don't want to hear what i am telling so i have got a very few uh, uh, Um, what i should say viewers i don't get much of views who will listen all these things it will not bring you money it will not give you any business policy it will not give uh, your wealth it will not create your wealth so don't bother all these things don't listen all these things they are wastes of time but no for me this is the real time that i'm exposing to the people of the whole world not only in uh, west bengal not only i'm sitting in calcutta not only in india but of the whole world so they have, do not have the proper judgment they do not have the proper wisdom they have only desire and then desire the satisfy their whole of their life and for that they don't bother good bad holy unholy na to and you know they only want to satisfy their own urge the strong desire their greed for wealth greed for women greed for you know, wine um, all these things so these two mantras i have explained you uh, um, today just just remembering the veer das what is has done or will be doing or the millions of virdas in india living in india and destabilizing our country and making us unhappy it is an you know the in full of anxiety so these burgers you know these burgers they are practicing bagari with the reputation of bharata so they are the burger exhausting the spirit of indian culture they are the bug they are the burger they are the bug they are the bugger spoiling the spirit of our indian culture today i am leaving you till then goodbye